on a Wednesday before Friday CPI, but we got to get there first. And tomorrow, John, ECB with some tough decisions. The Fed made a move last time around on its own. The ECB didn't come along for the ride. The BOJ didn't come for, along for the ride. This is different. The ECB is going to come along for the ride. Because the ECB has had the back of the peripheral markets for so long, how do they thread this needle? How do they support the areas that are most at risk? The global economy is paying a very hefty price for the war that Russia is leading into Ukraine. And yes, this is pushing down uh, growth quite a lot. This market has obviously pose some unique challenges. Consumer confidence data around the world is predictive of recessions, predictive of a recession in the United States, in the UK, in Japan, and in Europe. Now you can ignore it, but this is the best data we have. Even with the OECD downgrading growth today, it's still a positive number. The tricky thing is that financial conditions in the US have tightened a fair amount. I'd be amazed if the Fed is able to go 50-50-50 at the next few meetings in a straight line without any pushback from markets.